We're here at Neville Mead Golf Course in gorgeous Prospect, Kentucky, and with me today is golf pro extraordinaire Robert Costello. Thanks so much for having us today. Well, thanks for coming out. This is great. Great to have you all here today. Yes, it's a beautiful day. Okay, so golf this golf season is in full swing, and you have a lot of exciting things coming up. But first of all, can we talk about the big anniversary and what you're doing to celebrate? Absolutely. I'm, I'm glad you asked about that. So this year is our 30th year anniversary of the club. We were started in 1991. Um, so we are doing a big celebratory opening day scramble on Saturday, March 27th. It's going to be an 11 o'clock registration, 12 o'clock shotgun start. And the, the big thing about that is we've been owned by the same family uh, for all 30 years, the English family. So uh, Pat and Sonny English uh, are going to be there in the inn. We're going to have a nice celebratory dinner outside, social, socially distant, um, and just kind of, and we're going to have a nice. Uh, you know, presentation, kind of going over all the things that have kind of happened throughout the 30 years, and it just would be great to have Pat and Sonny there talking about, you know, kind of how everything came to be, um, and just all the different memories throughout the, the 30 years, and also celebrating our, our awesome superintendent, Todd Smith, who's been here since the very beginning, um, and doesn't show any signs of slowing down ever, so um, he's done a fantastic job for all, for all 30 years. He's been here, he actually literally built the golf course uh, with, with our owners, so we're gonna we're gonna be able to hear from him as well too. But that'll be a fun event, um, and it'll be a, just a fun way to celebrate. You know, having the golf tournament, and also um, you know, hearing from from our owners and from Todd as well too. So that is so exciting, and I understand you also have some other really exciting tournaments coming up as well. We do. So uh, coming up soon is the is our kind of our icebreaker. It's a two man event called the Leprechaun. Um, it's a fun event, always centered around St. Patrick's Day every year. Uh, it's just, just a way to kind of, you know, everybody, especially this year, we have a lot of snow and ice, so everybody hasn't really been playing as much golf as they, as they probably would like to. So it's just a great way to kind of literally just break the ice, get back into the swing of playing. Uh, meant to be a very fun event. We even have a, a best dress contest. Everybody kind of dresses up, you know, in a St. Patrick's Day theme. So we're very excited about like seeing. Like leprechauns and whatnot. Absolutely. So we got, <laughs> I've heard there's some people out there to be wearing, you know, some, some green, you know, pinstripe suits and, and top hats and the whole deal. So, uh, so we do have a prize for that. It's a, it's a, it's a nice push now wingman speaker, which is a really, really cool deal. Uh, for whoever the best dress is that day too. So myself and and my assistant pros will, will be uh, judging that day who's the best dress for that contest. So that'll be more about you know less about the golf, more about the fun, and kind of getting back in the swing of playing golf. So that'll be a great tournament there. So Robert, are you going to dress up as a leprechaun? Absolutely. Yes. Oh, you are. You I are. Am. Yes. Yeah. That's part. That's part of the fun right there. Is, is I'll be I'll be I'll be dressed up as well too. So okay. Be... I'm going to be looking at your social media. <laughs> I better see there'll some be lot, pictures there'll be lots of this. lots of pictures posted. Absolutely. And <laughs> so, you also have something coming yeah. up for. For, for women golfers as well, right? Yes, so uh, Saturday, March the 20th. Um, so for, kind of for us, we've always had a, a ladies league on Thursday mornings, but this year we're gonna have a league on Tuesday evenings as well as Thursday mornings, plus having even more clinics as well too. So on uh, March the 20th, we're gonna have a meeting at 2.30 um, in the clubhouse and our upstairs, our open lounge, something like that. And just kind of go over all the schedules for the year. We're also gonna show off a lot of our different merchandise that we have for, for ladies. Um, and just a, just an exciting way to kind of you know to kind of it, we're growing our program, and uh, we already have a lot of uh, great you know ladies golfers that are out here. Um, we're gonna make this even even better going forward. So we're very excited about that. So if anybody wants to to come check that out, it's, it's Saturday, March the twentieth. Okay, Robert, what about all the young golfing yeah. aficionados out there? What do you have for them? So um, we just had our our kind of our kickoff day. Uh, to kind of show everybody, you know, you know the, the schedules for the year. Um, so going forward, we have our PGA Junior League. Uh, it's for, we have a 13 and under division. We also have a 17 and under division, which is new this year. That's for anybody who kind of aged out of that 13 and under division, who still wants to be involved in PGA Junior League. PGA Junior League is great. We do two practices per week. Uh, and we also have matches on weekends. So every single weekend we play against different local area clubs. Um, so you get the instruction as well as the as well as the matches. It's fantastic. We also have clinics. Uh, we also have camps that we do as well. And we're also hosting uh, many different junior golf tours this year out here. Uh, we have some big ones here with the Kentucky PGA Junior Tour as well too. Um, so we're very excited about that. So uh, the, all the information is is available here. It's either on our website or through our social media accounts. So you can also always email me as well too, or give us a phone call as well too. So it's gonna be a big year for junior golf. We have uh, every year since since I've been here, we've kind of expanded and kind of added something in every single year. This year we really feel like we have something for every single different junior golfer that's out there. Boy or a girl, it doesn't matter how young, 
or how old you are so awesome okay and and what is that website and also your social media for anyone that wants to see robert dress as a leprechaun absolutely so uh so nevillemead.com is our website uh we also are on facebook instagram and twitter um and we we, we post uh, a lot of a lot of good stuff out there we always try to keep it very relevant to to our to our course and have some fun with it as well too and and yeah, stay tuned for the for myself dressed up as like as a as a leprechaun. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I can't wait for so. it. Robert, thank you so much for having us today. Thank you all. From Neville Mead Golf Course, I'm Joanne Dixon.